Works and Transport Minister Jenny Mutola made these remarks while addressing the Roads Authority and Roads Contractor Company staff members at Tongwe Diva. The Roads Authority and Roads Contractor Company are tasked with managing the national road network and to undertake work relating to the construction or maintenance of roads in accordance with the law. The two entities are thus expected to have an interdependent positive sound working relationship to construct roads and maintain them effectively, says Mutolwa. He is, however, disappointed that some leaders in Roads Authority divert work to private companies or joint ventures for self-enrichment, resulting in RCC not having any work to do. I think this creation of so many private companies and joint ventures, I think is robbing this country of many, many resources. Because some of the joint ventures and companies that are created by individuals are there just to enrich individuals. But here we have got a public duty to do. And the public duty is we must provide road services to our people, particularly in those areas. I mean, in this part of the world, here, you go up to, 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 to Katima there, because this was the operational area, it was the war zone. How many people to get to their villages, to get to their farms, to get to their cattle posts or farms there. Maybe it's a road of 20 kilometers, but you spend I don't know how many hours there. Sent, steep sent, in Kavango there, in Katima, Angwena, Oshikoto, Oshana here, up to, don't talk about the poor. There's a, there's a gap. People want the roads. And therefore, whatever scarce resources we have, must be utilized with these papers. In the same vein, Mutola coordinators to expand its offices and testing centers to address the current overcrowding and congestion being experienced at existing centers. From Kurenkuru to Rundu, you are talking about 145 kilometers. But from Rundu to Divundu, you are talking about 200 kilometers. And from Divundu to Katimamulilo, you are talking about 300 kilometers. Now, somebody from Divundu must come 200 kilometers in Rundu just to get a license or something. Some people arrive there 6 o'clock in the morning. Then they, they are overcrowded there. Yeah. So these services, some people, they look as if they are not important. These are basic, very, very important services. Tonight, any embodied NBC News, Ngwediva.